Create a quote for your services and get it to your customers fast with Magaya Software. Watch this video to find out how. Hi, I'm Franco from Magaya Customer Support. For this video, I will be showing you how to create a cargo quote manually and add a container to it. Click Add and select Cargo Quotation. There are a few tabs here, but we recommend starting on the General tab. All these details will fill into a quotation document automatically when you're done here. I will show you how to change the document template after we finish this step. Show or hide details here based on what you need. Some information is filled in automatically, such as a quote number, date, and your name. The quotation number comes from the configuration menu. The expiration is 30 days by default. One of the automation features in Magaya software is this payment terms field. If you define payment terms or income terms in a customer's profile, the terms will appear here automatically. See our other video, Managing Payment Terms. Click the link. Do you know you can use a quote as an open quote? Then you can use it many times as a template to create many transactions. This section of the screen is all about your customer or lead, also called a prospect. Select the customer or type in the prospect's name. If the lead accepts a quote, their information will be added into your customer list automatically. Select the shipping information such as the mode of transportation, direction, and more. To add a predefined clause to the quotation, click the bottom with the three dots next to the description of goods field. The item info section is the place you list any containers, pallets, or items you are quoting. Here's how you quote one or more containers. Select the container type from the container package drop-down menu. The default is one container. To quote more than one container of that size and type, edit the pieces field. Edit the other fields for the description, weight, or volume if needed. Then click Add to add the container to the list below. Not quoting a container? No problem, just click Add. Then click the line to highlight it, double click it to open it. This will open the commodity dialog box where you can select an existing part number. To get items from a warehouse receipt or pickup order, click the Get Items button. Note, when doing this, you will not be able to create any other transaction from this quote because it can't be linked to more than one transaction. Now let's go to the routing tab. If you already selected a mode of transportation, it displays here. Please note, if you do not select the mode, you will not be able to add freight charges. The main carrier is the carrier from the port of loading to the port of unloading. If the carrier has automated charges assigned to it, they will appear in the quote. Yet another nice benefit of the automation features you can take advantage of in the software. The route field is optional. Select the port of loading for the origin and the port of unloading for the destination. The pre-carriage and on-carriage fields are activated for the ocean mode. In the destination name field, select the name of the final consignee from the drop-down menu. Leave this field blank if you don't have the details now. Change the address for the destination by clicking the Change button. Now, let's add your charges so you get paid for freight services, documentation, and other fees. Click Add. If your system has automated expense charges defined for quotations, those expense charges will appear automatically on the quotation. Get more details about the charges in our knowledge base. Click OK to save the quotation. Do you want to change the template? Click Actions and select Template. Try one. You can always change it back before you print or send it. To make any other changes, click Edit. For example, at events, which is very useful for NVO CCs. Attach a document or photo or add notes. Explore the quotations list to see quote status, expiration dates, and more. From the Actions button, choose columns and select what you want to see. Filter the list by preset date ranges or by using the standard or advanced filter to view the information you want. Then save the view. When the customer accepts the quote, Convert it into another transaction by clicking the Actions button and selecting the transaction you want to create. All the data is carried over, saving you time and data entry. Do you know Magaya Software can save rates to help create quotes faster? If you need to create quotes for inventory, ask about our supply chain solution. Be sure to watch our other videos, subscribe to our channel, and check out the knowledge base for step-by-step -step articles to help you get the most from your Magaya Software. Thanks for watching.